In this video, I will design a direct form 2 structure for given digital filter. Realize the following digital filter using a direct form 2 structure. H of Z that is transfer function is given. So here H of Z consists of numerator as well as denominator that is it consists of poles as well as zeros. So numerator is with respect to zeros and denominator is with respect to poles as it contains poles and zeros so it belongs to IR filter suppose if we consider this is a transfer function h of z let x of z is the input and let y of z is the output now I will split this h of z into two sub functions say h1 of z and h2 of z i will connect these two let input to the h1 of z is x of z let this is y of z that is i have divided h of z into two sub blocks or two sub functions h1 of z and h2 of z here let w of z be the intermediate output which acts as the output of first block and input for the next block. The system transfer function h1 of z is with respect to poles and let h2 of z is with respect to zeros that is zeros means numerator poles means denominator. Now I can write the system transfer function h1 of z as h1 of z is equal to output by input output of h1 of z is w of z and input is x of z is equal to as i said h1 of z is with respect to poles equal to poles poles means the denominator so we supposed to take it as 1 upon 1 plus 1.3 z inverse plus 0 0.5 z power minus 2 plus 0 0.7 z power minus 2 minus 3 plus 0 0.3 z power minus 4. Now I will simplify this. I will cross multiply so that I can write w of z into we have this entire term that is 1 plus 1.3 z inverse plus 0 0.5 z power minus 2 plus 0 0.7 z power minus 3 plus 0 0.3 z power minus 4 is equal to we have x of z now I will multiply w of z with each term so that I can write w of z plus 1.3 z inverse w z plus 0 0.5 z power minus 2 w of z plus 0 0.7 z power minus 3 w of z plus 0 0.3 z power minus 4 w of z is equal to x of z now I will rewrite this expression as w of z is equal to x of z I will take all these terms on right hand side so that it is 1.3 z inverse w of z minus 0 0.5 z power minus 2 w of z minus 0 0.7 z power minus 3 wz plus 0 0.3 z power minus 4 w of z now i will take inverse z transform of this equation now taking inverse z transform so that i can write w of n is equal to x of n minus 1.3 inverse z transform of w of z into z inverse is x of n minus 1 minus 
जीरो पॉइंट फाइव एक्स ऑफ एन माइनस टू माइनस जीरो पॉइंट सेवन दिस इज एक्स ऑफ एन माइनस थ्री प्लस दिस इज जीरो पॉइंट थ्री एक्स ऑफ एन माइनस फोर कॉल इट एज इक्वेशन वन so similarly now we'll now i will consider the block h2 of z which is with respect to zeros input for this is w of z and output is y of z therefore i can write h2 of z is equal to out output is y of z divided by input is w of z is equal to which is with respect to numerator that is 0.7 Plus one point four z inverse plus zero point seven z power minus two plus zero point five z power minus three. <coughs> Therefore, I can simplify this as I will multiply w of z with each term zero point seven w of z plus one point four z inverse w of z. Plus zero point seven z power minus two w of z plus zero point five z power minus three w of z. So now taking inverse z transform, inverse z transform of y of z is y of n is equal to. 0.7 inverse z transform of w of z is w of n plus 1.4 inverse z transform of z inverse w of z is w of n minus 1 similarly 0.7 w of n minus 2 plus 0.5 w of n minus 5 we'll call it as equation 2 now using equation 1 and 2 i will realize direct form two structure let the input is x of n let this is intermediate output that is w of n here as we see w of n is equal to x of n minus 1.3 w of n minus 1 w of n minus 1 is obtained by passing w of n signal through delay element so now i will pass this w of n through delay element z inverse the output here available is w of n minus 1 so i will connect this one to here here we can see that the coefficient of w of n minus is minus 1.3 that is nothing but the multiplication factor minus 1.3 next we have minus 0.5 w of n minus 2 here w of n minus 1 is available pass this through another delay element so output of this will be w of n minus 2 so take one more adder here connect this one to here the multiplication factor is minus 0.5 this is minus 0.5 so now pass through another delay element the output of this is w of n minus 3 we have minus 0.7 connect this one here minus 0.7 pass through another delay element z power minus 1 because here we have w of n minus 4 multiplication factor is plus 0.3 so it is connected here 0.3 it should be connected like this
so this diagram is with respect to equation 1 now in equation 2 we have y of n is equal to 0 0.7 w of n so here i'll take one adder let the output of this is y of n and the input is this one connected like this so this is w of n here we can see that y of n is equal to 0 0.7 w of n here w of n signal is available multiply this with 0 0.7 then we have 1.4 w of n minus 1 here w of n minus 1 structure signal is available so from here i will take that is 1.4 1.4 it should be connected here then we have 0 0.7 w of n minus 2 here we can see that w of n minus 2 signal is available so take one more adder connect this one to here the multiplication factor is 0 0.7 this is 0 0.7 connect this one to here next we have 0 0.5 w of n minus 3 this is supposed to be 3 so here w of n minus 3 is available so connect this one to here like this so here multiplication factor is 0 0.5 so this is direct form to structure Thank you for watching.